Hey everybody, welcome aboard. Today we're going to go on a little excursion, a little trip across the Canada-USA border into Niagara Falls, New York. That's right, New York State from Canada. It hasn't happened in almost two years time. Almost two years. We have not been able to freely cross the border into the States as well as the Americans crossing into Canada. So, what has happened is they've opened it up, the land border, to allow people to cross back and forth. Just until recently, we had to have a PCR test to come into Canada for anybody. Right now, they changed it as of December the 1st, 2021, that we Canadians can cross into the States for less than 72 hours and not have to get a COVID PCR test to return home. We still have to fill out an app on the phone or whatever. And um, it's kind of a pain that way, but however, at least we can freely cross the border. Americans on the other hand, unfortunately for you folks, you still need that PCR test to cross the border into Canada. What can you do? Hopefully that is going to change very soon. Now, remember, hit the like button there. Give us, a, give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you'd like to see some more videos and be warned, you know, be warned that they're coming. Anyway, uh, I have a special guest at the very end of the video. And I would like for you to comment and tell me if you can understand what he is saying to us. Two different things. Alrighty, enjoy the video. Thank you again for watching. And soon to come will be a video about a hotel on the American side of the Niagara Falls River. Or the Niagara River in Niagara Falls, New York. Thank you. Enjoy the video. Where are we today? Queenston Bridge. Queenston Lewiston? Yep. Bridge across the border. Ontario, Canada to... Niagara Falls, New York. And this is the, to us, the grand opening of the border. And you can see there's a bit of a backup. I'm not sure the delay time. They have three open, three lanes open. Well, here we are. We made it across the border really quick. We started the line up at a, uh, I don't know that's showing up on the camera. 11.18, I believe. 11.18 a.m. and it's 11.36 a.m. We got through the border. No issues at all with the American Customs guy. Really nice fella. Just said, where you're going? He said, going across for a couple of nights. Go do some shopping. Gave us back our passports and said, there you go. That was it. So we're in the States. I feel like getting out of the car and kissing the ground. <laughs> Have, yeah. Feels like I've never, was never ever going to get back across the border. Let's just hope going back the other direction, the customs people are just as nice and friendly. Alrighty. I'm going to hang up the camera. We're going to come back later. Porter Packard, one mile. Uh, is that where I get off? You can if you want. Might as well. Okay. Alrighty. So that's one mile. Yep. Not so, one mile. Nobody behind me. No, you're all sitting back on the bridge. Yeah, they all got pulled over. One in front of us, they got pulled over for secondary inspection. So there they are checking some people out for whatever reasons they feel they need to. coming up. Here we go. Porter and Packard. Let's get off here. Highway. And? 20 miles an hour. Then I turn left. We are here. Correct? Yeah, you get down on the bottom, get to the light, turn left. Alrighty. So we are at the Outlet Mall in Niagara Falls. Yes. And uh, nobody has to wear masks. No, there could be no mask. Because this is Niagara County. Yeah. No mask required. If we were down the road, I guess, in Erie County, in Buffalo, we'd have to... I guess that's Erie County. 
you'd have to wear a mask. People mm. are, but this is such a change. We're not used to this. This is yeah. like a, no, it's no. almost like a whole new country. I could touch my face. But let's have a look. What's your, this is a medium, medium. Philly yes, cheesesteak. Oh my God, look at how big it is. It's medium. Look at the pickle, look at the, the cheese. Oh, sort the ordered from, small. Yeah, look at this. What do the french fries look like? Okay, let's have a look at the french fries. And this is supposed to be regular. Well, that's okay. We're gonna try. Yeah, that's okay. Now, are you going to try that? Oh, I do not Okay, here we go. She's going to try to eat this thing. It's like a sub. Let me grab it. There's so much Holy cheese. Holy Christ, you guys got a small. If I had known, and if I had known, I didn't know that this it was going to be that good. big. To me, that would be a large. And that was how much? Nine bucks or something? Yeah. What'd mm -hmm. the whole bill come to? We got no drinks, just regular fry and two medium. With $22.54, but we got the fries. So this sandwich is $9.29 each. The fries are $2.29 each. Then there's good old times. So, all righty. All right, let's Time eat. Time to eat. That is one store I'm not going into. <laughs> you too? Yeah. You never catch me in that place. And there's a baby place up here. Right so here are the outlet mall. Let's walk around a little bit. Yeah, which way did we go? Get in that way behind us. You see what they got here? The gap. Yes. Okay, somebody with the buggy with cleaning supplies. Yes. Yeah, for across the border back home, you wouldn't see the food court open like that. It's crazy at home, but here, at home, last mall I was in, they had it roped off. And they had a security guard making sure you had your COVID vaccine passport with you. All that kind of crap. Here in uh, Niagara Falls, New York, they aren't worried about that sort of baloney. It's almost like normal. It's normal here. Any Canadian seeing this, that's it's like normal. And okay, what did she find? All right, the kid comes out of her now. So let's click a little. I'm not going to show any more of the outlet mall here, but what? Tony? Tony Tiger. Tony is a tiger?